Hi, welcome to the Market Alert for Thursday, the 15th of January 2015. Starting off with the five minute chart, we can see that the start of the session was once again quite volatile. This uh, first price bar of the trading session uh, is uh, around 77 points in uh, its range from the low to the high. You can see the market trading through the 17,400 only to find professional selling coming in. We then see a bit of support coming in with buying pressure there and then prices driving back through the resistance of 17,400 in this bar. Then we see further selling coming into the market and uh, the next bar is an interesting bar because we actually see low volume there and that low volume indicates that the selling that was around here has now been absorbed or disappeared and then you can see the new buying coming in to move the market through this uh, resistance level and then price is driving up through the next one as well of course uh, through the 17,450 we see some uh, potential weakness there in the up thrust and then once price is uh, closed back below the 17,450 we see prices trading back down to the 17,400 trading back up to the 450 and then through this we see prices trading down to the uh, 350 level there 17,350 back up to 4,000 and once through this we see the market uh, trading three quarters of the way through down towards the 17,300 level back to 350 but eventually coming back to this level again at uh, 350 and then we see the market moving lower this signal generated on a bar uh, range of uh, no more than uh, 25 points and in fact this one actually turned out to be uh, a 20 point bar or less as well so uh, if I change this to 20 you can see there that that meets the original default setting of 20 points for the range set to 25 at the moment because of the amount of volatility that we have in the market so there we see the market trading through going through the scalp and heading down towards the uh, 17,250 level there but definitely a good 20 plus points in this uh, trade for yesterday before we see the professional buying coming into the market and again you can see this driving through these areas 50 points plus in this bar as the market drives back through the 350 level all the way up to 400 back to 350 and then you can see there back through 350 heading back towards uh, uh, sorry be above the 17,400 they're heading back to the uh, 17,450 but you can see how powerful these psychological lines are and how the market actually uses these as uh, targets for either reversing or to take profits in the daily charts you can see the market coming off the lows yesterday largest volume day now for some time uh, it goes back to the mid-December pre-Christmas there so you can see a lot of buying coming into the market coming off the lows massive buying pressure yesterday and as a result of this you can already see prices on the overnight market heading back to the upside so expect uh, prices to continue in this direction however that said the news today there's an interesting one at 3 p.m. we've got the Philly Fed manufacturing index out and this is forecast to be 20.3 from 24.5 if the actual figure comes out uh, less than the uh, forecasted figure then uh, we can expect uh, a bit of weakness in the market around 3 p.m. Whether the market absorbs this and then moves back to the upside remains to be seen. But just be aware at 3 p.m. we have this previous at 24.5 and forecast. So quite a, a drop off in this uh, figure. And then the German uh, president is uh, speaking, uh, Bubba, at uh, 4.15. So again, there could be a bit of volatility around that time too. So watch out uh, for this uh, news at uh, 3 p.m. Also, let's just have a, a quick look at uh, where the market could trade back to if we have a really strong up move. We've got uh, these two areas of uh, resistance at uh, 17,669 and 17,763. Again, yesterday you can see the market trading down to the uh, FIB support there at 17,292, trading just below it with uh, a low of uh, 17,254 before reversing 
and moving back to the upside there. Okay, so have a quick look at uh, the implied volatility, if the uh, server will work. They seem to have a problem at the moment. No, we're okay, we're actually in there, so let's just have a quick look. And yesterday the volatility increased into 16.38, which is what we'd expect because the market uh, went down sharply and then recovered for the remainder of the session. So. 16.38, a lot of volatility around at the moment. Again, this is seen in the chart and also, of course, uh, in the figures there as well. Right, that's it uh, for today. I'll see you in tomorrow's edition of the Market Alert. Have a good day. As ever, thank you for your support. Very much appreciated. And uh, as ever, thanks for watching. I will see you uh, in the next one.